Getting it in, DVD. We about to set it off. Jin DVD. Duck down. Getting it in, because we getting it in. BDI Buckshot, a.k.a. Hustle and Flow. My man, Drew High. Duck down. Getting it in. Duck down. We have in here. Right, man. We could use you, though. We grinding. How you want to do this? You want to know where you I'm here. I ain't going nowhere, man. That's where you I, ain't, I ain't never going nowhere. I'm here. Where I been at? I, I feel like our history speaks for itself. It's not about like how you feel. I would just say put on a catalog. Like we have records from 93 to 2005. Like we've been in there for a minute. So I feel like that speaks for itself. Right now, we just, you know what I'm saying, we letting everybody check out the, the boot camps, you know what I'm saying, surveillance video. It's, it's letting everybody see every last video that we've ever shot from Who Got the Props up until, you know. It's every video that we've ever shot, you know, from, from Who Got the Props, Bucktown, Soundboy Burial, all the videos. You can check for it. Um, you know, a lot of people knew about our history, but they didn't really get a chance to see all the videos. So this is a chance to see our videos. I feel good about hip hop. Like, I, I remember being coming into the game in 93, 94, and seeing a lot of people back then complain about the game. And I remember how I felt about them complaining. At the time, I didn't like it. And I would never complain about the game. I feel like the game constant, constantly takes it to another level. It's different people introducing different styles and bringing the game to another level. I feel like the people that are on top right now deserve to be on top. I remember 10 years ago, 11 years ago, it was Vanilla Ice at the Grammys, Young MC at the Grammys, MC Hammer at the Grammys. Today it's a Missy, a Jay-Z, a Ludacris. They nasty, they, des they deserve that spot. So I feel good about where hip hop is going. You know, you gotta, as, as an artist that have been in it, you gotta stay consistent, you gotta keep reinventing yourself, and you gotta keep being relevant. So, I'm not mad at hip hop right now, I'm not mad at all. Hip hop is good, it is what it is. I'm not gonna say, I, I, I feel it, you know. It is good, it is. I, Who you listening to? I listen to a lot of people. I listen to whatever's, whatever's jumping. Paul Wall, the South, I mean, Wheezy, New York. 50, I mean, I listen to hip-hop. I listen to what's going on right now. I, I would cool. say, if they was mad at me, they wouldn't be with me. And you could ask any dude, any MC in boot camp, I've never had, no, like, physically, I've never had no paper contract. I'm not, I'm, not, I'm never gonna sit here and be like, yo, you're signed to Duck Down, you gotta stay here. Like, boot camp is from Brownsville, Brooklyn, most of them. Y'all know what Brownsville, Brooklyn is. If they wasn't happy with me, they wouldn't be with me. Cause do I look like, <laughs> do I look like I'm a threat to Brownsville, Brooklyn? No. And that's real talk. So I don't know. Like the rumors, and they not happy with like whatever. I, we we've been like one of the longest standing crews in hip hop for 13 years. Something's got to count for that. There's no paperwork. It's just respect. Any of my dudes want to leave, they can leave. Any of my dudes want to stay, they stay, and we constantly put out records. I'm going to work on a new album, new Black Moon mixtape, and then I'm also going to work on another Night Wonder joint. We coming, man. We, we don't stop. I mean, it don't stop. It's like shaking the dice, man. We just keep rolling, you know? We just keep rolling, you know what I'm saying? But I, I can say this, Duck Down, Duck Down is consistent. We got a lot of new projects coming out, and all we got to do is keep checking for us, you know? Go to duckdown.com, go to our website. We here, man. You know nah, I, mean? I don't rhyme. I, I don't rhyme. You know, like, I, I learned to respect, like, I learned to respect what hip-hop is and that MCs that do it. I don't believe in dudes writing rhymes for people. I don't believe in... I, yo, hip hop is an art, man. I, I, it's like professional baseball. A lot of people throw the ball around in the backyard. A lot of people play rec. A lot of a lot of people might make it to the minor leagues, but only a few make it to the major leagues. And the dudes that make it to the major leagues, they there for a reason. And that's what we should all respect. Like the art of the professional MC, it's another level. And I, I respect that to the fullest. I fuck around. <laughs> I've come. On, I've always fucked around. They, you know. But I, I don't rhyme, and I would never compare myself to a real MC. We do what we do. Whether they may not be people that play like us, but we still do what we do. You know. I mean, maybe there's not people who are as good as we are, but I still feel like we are good as we are. You know what I'm saying? I feel like maybe there's not people that as nice as we are, but I'ma still listen to other people. When you stop listening to people for a reason, 
I think that's when you start getting unentuned. And to me, I just like hip hop. I'm not. I don't know, you know what I mean? I grew up on hip hop. A lot of people throw up the flag and be like, independent hip hop is the way to go. Independent hip hop is a way to go, not the way, a way to go. Like if you can't get major, then do something. I believe in doing something rather than doing nothing. I'm not proud of being completely independent. And you know, that that's just, it's, it's an alternative for us. Until we catch the major's eye, then we're gonna constantly keep putting it out. If you look at the history of boot camp, we've always been on independent labels. Nervous Records, Priority Records. Priority was half a major, but even as being the East Coast group on a label that was West Coast, Ice Cube, Master P, Dr. Dre, we were the only East Coast label. We was independent over here. Like, they were a staff of 72, and on the East Coast, they were a staff of seven. So, you know what I'm saying? Like, look, if you out there doing it, put your records out. Try to make your bread. Try to put something out and be heard rather than doing nothing. Don't wait for Leo or Cohen to knock on your door because he's not going to just knock on your door until you get him excited. So that's what we do. We put out independent records. We win at it. We make bread. We, we survive. That's why we've been doing it since, what, 1993? But if you ask me if one of those motherfuckers called me, I would take the call in a heartbeat. So, you know, we're going to do it independent as long as we can. If we could take one of our artists to that next level, we're going to do that also. Hip-hop is about life. And even though hip-hop is about life, people are expressing what they go through in life. Me, I get money. And I'm not... Hip-hop is a representation of life. And I'm not about bringing that aspect of things and drowning it in hip-hop. But I'm about... I've always been about getting my money. Yeah. Salute to all my comrades out there. I be the general STWELE representing for my boot camp. You know what I'm saying? One half of Smith and Wesson, one A for the grade A. You know what I'm saying? B to you all day, every day. Doing it with my people. You know what I mean? Getting it in TV. Gin. Toss it up, baby. Pour it out. My dudes ain't here no more. Brooklyn, stand up. Boot camp for life, baby. Let's go. You mind if I kick it with you a second? Yeah, yeah, let's do it. Everybody want to know where the eight been, like what's been popping like? Well, the eight been scattered, man. You know what I mean? The eight been scattered. You know, there's no doubt about that. But uh, but the five, the power five, Sean Price, Ruck, you know what I mean? Rock, you know what I mean? Steel, Tech, Buckshot, we've been on the move. We just actually came from Europe doing a little thing for the boot camp out that's coming out July 18th. And, um, you know, really, that's what's on the forefront right now, you know what I mean? So that DVD um, compilation just dropped, how's, the, how's that looking for y'all? The DVD compilation, talking about the DVD yeah, with, with all, the the, all the videos yeah. on it? Oh man, that's, that's super, baby. That's super because that, that documents our whole history since we since our first coming into the game. Like, um, we have, we have, we have, cra I mean, boot camp wise, we have crazy videos online, so it's only just like a tribute to our fans, like just showing our fans, like we hear you, we love you, we want to give you everything that you need to have, and we put that out there, you know what I mean, surveillance, and hopefully they can enjoy that, and, and um, you know, for the cast that's seen it, get a refurbishment of what's going on, and the cast that didn't see it, and you're like, yeah, you know, all right, I see what's going on with this cast, so we hit. Yeah, it's your boy Henny Brooklyn Style, you know how we do. You gonna see me on Gen TV getting it in, you know what I mean? And that's how we do. Henny, holla. Yo, it's Drew High, getting it in with my mans and them. Put something on from that Duck Down catalog. I don't care what it is, anything. We got history. Duck Down. I'm fly like cloud 10. Troop thug from the street, stay wild and bent. Walk with a big one that'll break your hip. Can't run, I got love for them chicks on that snake tip. First night, no chips.